Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza here, and uh, fuck the Cubs, and fuck the Indians. And by that I don't mean, like, the actual Native Americans, I mean fuck the Cleveland Indians, because you had one job! You were ahead 3-1 to one in the World Series, and you totally, you know, had, like, fucking an alcoholic Taco Bell binge, and shit all over the bed, and then you blew it. And me, as a White Sox fan, the most infuriating thing. It is. It is one of the most infuriating things. I mean, I was. I like. I was. A few days ago, I was just like beaming with excitement because they were gonna make it there and they weren't gonna win. And I was gonna be like, ha ha, keep the streak going for another 108 years, you assholes. And then it all just went crashing down in a fucking puddle of smoke. A puddle of smoke. That's not even a thing that's even possible. But now it is, because I made it so. And, uh, I'm just, hey, I'm just a man that's upset right now. And then to make matters worse, the Blazers lost on a fucking bullshit game winner that was not cool. So, pretty much you could say that a lot of facets of my day have not been great. <laughs> However, in a more serious situation, oh yeah, yeah, throw one of those at me, why don't you? That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt pretty bad. Okay, not as bad as I was thinking. You go right ahead and do that, but this is gonna hurt you more than it's gonna hurt me. <laughs> oh, it's like a dad spanking his kid in the ass for the first time. <laughs> in the ass, not on the ass. He's, he's actually spanking him so hard that it's going into his ass, which actually would be horrifically painful if, if one had to guess. Um... Okay, I gotta gotta think about this. I really hate navigating these rooms, man. They're the worst. Okay, so I'm really hoping that our our uh, our full platter of mind games ends up working out really well. Uh, mind games, psychic people, do do do. Um, and if if not, then it's gonna be you know kind of an issue. The thing about it is that we don't really have any big advantages. Actually, I don't even know if we even have any advantages at all during the course of this, which is kind of shitty. It kind of sucks that we don't really have that. Um, and then to make things worse, we do have some disadvantages. Which, realistically, the only true disadvantage is Neo. Um, so we just, we don't really have, like, a complement of things that are strong against them, which is pretty shitty. Oh, great. Fantastic. Now he's gonna start doing one of these. Well, I'll give him one of these then. See how much he enjoys being paralyzed. Even though it doesn't really work that often. <laughs> as I as I live and breathe, here he goes throwing one out of his little bendy spoon there, and he's dead. <laughs> well, that was great. Okay, well let's bring Kimbo back out. Maybe he can maybe he can uh, he can dig it. Okay. Come on. Come on! I know you got what it takes in there. Yeah, alright. Good job. Hey, all right. See, at least he's getting up there too. Um, Slowpoke. See, that would have been perfect for uh, for Radigan to be out there for, but no. Okay, let's let's switch it up then. Um, hmm. I mean, I guess he is technically going to be part water, so we'll do this. But I I intentionally didn't put Neo out here last time in the same situation because of of the psychic deal. But who knows? Oh, I didn't even mean to do that! I meant to do Razor Leaf! Oh, shit. Okay. Wow, we got really lucky on that. <laughs> he totally had the opportunity to use Confusion, and he didn't. And I'm cool. I mean, he, he definitely doesn't look like, you know, the smartest dude in... in oh, my God. Wow. Okay. All right. Ten points higher on the power scale, and that thing really, really makes a difference. Okay, let's take that out. Let's go with Drain. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna. Uh, ugh. God, he's just so gross looking. It also looks like he's in a very, very uncomfortable position that his legs don't really seem like would hold up very well. Like he's got a, he's got a very, very, very kind of pudgy midsection, and then just like these total, like little stick figure legs. It, it's like how is, how is all that weight being supported? <laughs> I don't really know. I mean, even he looks like he, he doesn't really understand it. He's like, dude, I shouldn't be eating what I'm eating all the time. Like, I'm knocking out four boxes of mac and cheese a day, and I can see it really hitting the wrong place. <laughs> okay, well, here we go. I'm going to give you one of these. Oh, shit. 
Don't you dare. Don't you... Okay. That's not that bad, actually. I mean, as a Kadabra, when you know... When you know Psybeam, why would you ever be using anything else ever? That's... That's the thing. I mean, Psybeam is so much better. It is so wildly better. Oh, come on. We're really gonna do this little move today? That This is really what's going on? Every time I hit you, you're just gonna recover it all? I'm really hoping I can, like, freeze him in place. Well, now he wants to do it. Yeah, it just, it seems weird, you know? Especially, like, early in a fight, that you would use a significantly worse move on purpose. It's like, oh, well, you know, I could use Psybeam as it is my best move, but... You know, I really do like that confusion move. It makes a great starter for a fight, beside the fact that it totally does nothing. Oh my god! Oh! Yeah! Cool! Alright! I for totally forgot about that. I thought he didn't evolve until like 36, so... <laughs> Alright. I'm happy now. He's like, so am I! God! Now things are on! Okay, what do we got? You, huh? Alright. Let's do it! Oh, by I, I definitely uh, got to see something really weird for the first time today. Yeah, I I do want to see Sabrina, and I guess you can tell. You ain't gotta say too much from the look in your eyes. I can tell you wanna fuck. <laughs> that's the weird. That that is one of the weirdest songs that there is. It is also one of the dirtiest songs that there is. But it's. It's just like, that dude's voice is just so strange to me. It just, it, it sounds like so nasally and just like so fucking weird and devious. It's funny. He just has this like... Nye, 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 nye. But uh, hey, you know, dude's making a lot of money out of that and there's probably plenty of people that are just screwing each other's brains out to it. So, I mean, I guess, uh, I guess it was a success in the long run. Okay, well that was a pretty easy one. It's crazy that Neo is being effective against psychics. It's uh, it's just mind-boggling. However, I think it would be good if we okay. We need to we need to bring some people back. We can bring him back. We can bring him back. He'll be stronger than ever before until he takes two confusions and he dies again. We do have some super potions we can use. But yeah, so I um, so I went down to T-Mobile today. I had to take care of some uh, some billing issues, um, which also, by the way, I totally decided to bite the. I was telling you guys about this the other day, but I decided to bite the bullet, and I got my uh, iPhone 7 Plus activated. Which this phone is sick. It's it's actually pretty beefy. Like it, it it's it's like literally the size of my of my fully extended hand. Um, so it's a little bit uncomfortable sometimes, but overall, it's actually not that bad. Uh, I, I really, I, I really was actually anticipating it being bigger than that, but it actually, I'm getting used to it fitting in my hand, but that's besides the point. Uh, the, the deal is, is, when I pulled up into the parking lot of this place, I kind of pulled up on the street, and this car, that was, uh, it, it drove right by me, and, and seriously, right as it drove by on, on my right here, it totally blew a tire, and I've never actually, I've never actually, like, seen a tire blow out before, um, nor have I actually heard it, like, not from, like, not being in the car when it happened. It sounds a lot different outside of the car than it does inside of it, I can tell you that right now. And, it, it, like, what it sounded like to me, because it was really loud, it sounded like somebody, oh, really? You're gonna get me with my own move, huh? He's actually gonna try to, oh, he's gonna go with Nightshade? Why the hell would you not use Dream Eater right now? I mean, you intentionally put me to sleep for that. Okay, well, I got the flute. I'll, I'll wake myself back up. Good luck with that shit. But, yeah, it's, it sounds drastically different outside of a car than it does inside. It's, it's actually quite strange. Oh, I'm gonna get you now. I'm gonna get you with your own brew. Come on, come on, live through it. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're gonna get it so bad. Give me that dream, my friend. Give me that dream of you, uh, porking Jenna Jameson in the back of a Popeye's parking lot. Yeah! I don't know why it had to be that, but... <laughs> but, hey, you never know. I, I feel like there are people that still have dreams about Jenna Jameson, even though I feel like that was much more of, like, a, uh... Like a 90s... 90s and very early 2000s dream when she 
you know, didn't look like a like a pile of old t-shirts or something. <laughs> oh, but yeah. But yeah, so like anywho, like when I heard this thing explode, like it, it I like I looked over just to like just to make just to see, you know, I don't even know why I even looked over that way cuz I didn't really have any reason objectively to do that. But I looked over at this car right as it passed and I and I looked and I just saw that its front left tire just go and uh, the sound that it made was just so weird. It sounded like uh, like those really shitty fireworks, like the ones that kind of they kind of look like I don't really not like plungers, but they kind of I don't know. It's the ones that are really small, and you pull the string on them, and it they pop, and it shoots like the little crappy confetti out of it, like the little tiny thing of it, and uh, and it's just like they 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 cost like a quarter or whatever, and you're just like oh hey it's over. But it would be like that sound if you if you popped like 40 of them at the same time. And you know how they're like really loud? It was like that. And I was just like, holy shit. And this person, this person in like a moment of completely brilliant and, and insanely, um, insanely fast reflexes, like within, I'm going to say within like one and a half seconds of them blowing that tire, they like immediately swerved into the parking lot where where I was going. It was and they literally had such a small window of executing that because had they waited really any longer to do that, they would have gone straight into the intersection. <laughs> and I was just like, whoa, holy shit. I was like, how did that guy how did they have like the frame of mind? It's almost like they expected it to happen. Like it just it was just like this really quick just boom 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 type of sequence. It's like it's just pop swerve. <laughs> I was like, I've never seen that happen before. Usually, you know, it, it happens and you're it, like, you can, it, the person panics and they start kind of like fishtailing and they don't know what the hell they're doing. But this person was like so geared for the moment that, uh, oh man, it was awesome. Okay, here we go. Oh no, you don't. You're not gonna, you're not gonna hit me with hypnosis. He's the one doing it. He's, he's got the yo-yo, you know, he's, he's better equipped for this. You just get, you're just sitting there doing like this weird kind of grabby thing with your fingers like you're going to try to grab my tits while I'm in in full dream which is weird cuz I mean I'm a man I don't really I don't really have tits per se I mean I, I I do I do you know I do have nipples on my body which is weird like why why do men realist I I read a thing and I don't know if it's I don't know if it's true or not cuz you can only believe so much of what you actually hear on Twitter and they have like those Oh my God! Facts type of type of uh, pages that are there, and uh, and I I read this the other day, and I'm not sure whether I believe it or not, but it was um it was eh, we'll leave him out there. I was thinking about changing it, but we'll we'll leave him out there. Um, how about here? Are you a thing? No. What about here? No. Okay. Well, how about here? Okay, well, how about right here? I've already been to you. Oh, these things are so confusing. I hate them. Okay, we were, we were just there. How about here? Ha ha ha! Okay, that'll work. Um, but yeah, so I, I saw on this Oh My God Facts thing, it, it says the reason, the reason why men have nipples is because something about, like, in the womb... Like, at one point in the womb, like, everybody's a female. And I'm sitting here thinking, like... It wouldn't surprise me if that were a fact, but something tells me that that's not true. <laughs> but I don't know at the same time, so I just kind of... It's kind of one of those, hey, you throw your hands up and you're just like, alright, well, if that's what it is, that's what it is. But, I mean, I feel like male nipples virtually have, like, zero function at all. I mean, they're literally... I think it would look weirder if we didn't have them. Just having just blank space up here. I don't know. I think I think that visually that would look even more uncomfortable. Um, but, I don't, yeah, I just, it's, it just seems weird. Like, I think there have been, like, like cases of men lactating, which is weird. Um, but, I, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really know. I, I don't really know too much about that entire thing there. Uh, he's gonna use a ghastly, huh? Well, well, we'll roll with it. Oh, yes, we will. The confusion? The confusion. You're gonna, you're gonna confuse me, huh? <laughs> he's just gonna start swinging the yo-yo and, and, uh, and putting himself 
under hypnosis. He's like, you're getting very... Oh, fuck. <laughs> I done did it to myself. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Hey, alright, see, that's what I was hoping for. I don't know why I keep doing, like, the Fawns thing. Poison gas? Totally not gonna do poison gas. That's, like, arguably one of the least useful things that he could learn right now. Uh, we'll leave him out there, though. But yeah, so like that that pop tire thing was pretty weird. I just I, I I've not seen that happen before. Uh, but then again, I've also not seen myself attempt to eat. You know, like oh god. Oh oh, he didn't even put. Oh damn! I thought that he. Uh, I thought that he tried to. I thought he used hypnosis. Well, I really hope I can pull it off right now. And now we're not going to be able to do it. This is bad. Oh boy. Dude, if we can pull this off right now, this would be so awesome. Please, for the love of God, don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Oh, you idiot! Oh, boy! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, damn it. Oh, no. Oh, he hurt himself trying to use a move that he can't even use. That's the worst part of it. <laughs>
of, of 33s. This is crazy. All right, my friends. Well, we're going to stop, but when we come back, it's on. So until then, this is your host, Lovely Cheese Pete, saying thank you guys for watching, and I hope you guys come back for another one. I'll see you later. Bye.